first of all, you got to stay relaxed. Do you jerk off? Do I? Do I jerk off? Yeah, I jerk off. How many times a week? Like three or four, three or four times a week, maybe five. You got to pump those numbers up. Those are rookie numbers in this racket. I myself, I jerk off at least twice a day. Really? Once in the morning, then after I work out, and then once after lunch. Wow. I want to. That's not why I do it. I do it because I fucking need to. Think about it. You're dealing with numbers all day long. High frequencies, decimal points, bang, 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 ee, 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 fucking digits. <coughs> it's all above the shoulders mustard shit. All right? It kind of wigs some people out, right? You gotta feed the geese to keep the blood flowing. I keep the rhythm below the belt. Done. This is not a tip. This is a prescription. Trust me. If you don't, you'll fall out of balance, split your differential, and tip the fuck over. Or worse yet, I've seen this before, you'll implode. No, I don't want to implode, ma'am. No. No, you don't. Implosions are ugly. Pop off to the bathroom, work one out when you can, and when you get really good at it, you'll fucking be stroking and thinking about money. That was the first key to success. The name of the game, moving money from your client's pocket into your pocket. The second key to success is this little baby right here. It's called cocaine. Yes, sir. Revolutions. Keep the clients on the Ferris wheel. The park is open 24-7, 365, every decade, every goddamn century. I'm okay with the wheel, thanks. It's his first time on Wall Street, give him time.